Endoscopic carpal tunnel release. This technique with a single portal uses a small incision at the level of the wrist. This helps to avoid any type of painful scar in the palm. A flap of fascia is developed using these tenotomy scissors and retracted. This protects the palmar cutaneous branch of the median nerve. The carpal tunnel is dilated with the endoscopic dilators and then the device is inserted to a maximum depth of approximately three centimeters. This allows us to visualize the end of the uh, ligament and begin the release going from a distal to proximal fashion. Once the ligament has been, has been fully released, there's a dramatic increase in the space available for the median nerve. As demonstrated here, the proximal aspect of the form flexor retinaculum is released and then the wound can be closed with a running subcuticular suture. A bulky dressing is applied. No plaster splints are necessary. This dressing can be removed to approximately two days after surgery.